Hey guys, what's going on? John Haddock here from Think About Comics, joined by your boy William Bethay. Hey, so check it out. We got the latest issue of Batman, Batman '93. What you think, B? What you think hey, about it? I, I love it, man. Yo, the, the wild thing is the designer. You know, I, I I thought you know we was gonna get more out of this guy, but you know the joke showed his hand and then Batman with the hands on him. Next thing you know, it's Joker running the whole show. Yeah, man. I mean, oh. So, I wish I could say I was more surprised with that, with with the whole reveal of what this, what what became of the designer. Yeah, hey. but it just felt like the whole these whole Batman stories have been more focusing on punchline. Yes. than him. So I, I my my like uh, hype was more for her. Yep. And I think you know what she was able to do to Harley Quinn and Catwoman is like okay, this Put is somebody on. who is. Um, you know, no one, no one to mess with. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. what I, what I didn't, what, what I don't understand about what we see in this book is, you get her origin story sort of in yeah. the Joker book. Yeah, yeah. But the it's, Joker. it's nothing that would Im- imply me that where she would be this, you know, badass chick. Yeah. You know, and then you move on to, uh, I mean, physically, like yeah. we see her kill her dean or whatever mm-hmm. with chemicals, so she's legitimate there. But you know, now we're starting to see that unfold, and then we kind of don't see, you know. Well, I mean, so. My to my take on punchline is, you know, it's it's like she's been involved with him for a while now. Mm-hmm. So and then when she said we, it's like it kinda implied like it's a group of girls. It's like a it's like she's not the only cat. So you think there's more than one? You you I, think it's just not like when she said we, you didn't think of it as like, oh, me and the joke. No, nah, I think it's like a group of a group of girls. That's been eyeing to get that spot Holly Quinn had, and you know now that Holly didn't go on road, it's like she was able to slide in there. Okay. Yo, I I, I think I got that out of it, and thinking of it that way is like, I right, yo, these cats been fighting and training and doing whatever the whole time. You know what I'm saying? And Joker's so smart. Yo, I keep these girls on the side. And you know, if Harley ever went, you know, road, I got somebody that stepped right into the spot. That's interesting. So, I didn't think of it like I, I, hey, look, my, my, my man built armies, yo. <laughs> and now, you know, he the most wealthiest, crazy man in the world. You know what, what I'm saying? Was, what was your take on him getting on? So, pr- so, pretty much what happens is the whole thing was the, the, the designer's idea was stealing all of Wayne's money yeah. and funnel it into himself and creating this underworld. That doesn't work. Joker pretty much hijacks, hijacks it. What he do? You know, he ends up taking all the money. Yes. To me, I just didn't get, care about that plot twist. I was like, you know, this is a character that has never given a damn about money, and he doesn't. So now you say, I right, what's this crazy dude gonna do with all that money? But I mean, what, it's like, what what is he gonna buy? Like, what what did he need that he couldn't have just walked in and, and took? Nothing. But I think what it is is. You know, to take a jab at Bruce Wayne and the company. You know, I, I see that. yo, he wanted to show, yo, he can be just as manipulative as the designer was. But, you know, cause major chaos and mayhem with all his partners that he went to the table with. You know what I'm saying? Because that, that was the thing. Joker was the oddball in the team anyway. Yep. So now, I'm going to put it all in their face. I'm going to keep Batman alive because Batman going to spoil all this great stuff. But I'm still going to get the ultimate purpose done and everybody going to feel Everybody going to feel it. You know, yeah. Like, I see where you're coming from. Yo, so. Joker. Hey, look. I I, I am beginning to like the Joker more and more than I Do you know what I'm tired of seeing in, in, this, in this series? Like, I, I've liked uh, Tinion's run so far. Okay. I've I've really enjoyed it. Mm-hmm. I'm tired of seeing Deathstroke beat Batman. What the hell? Is, like we see him at Batman whoop his ass, then he comes back, and then he comes up and does this to Batman. It's like, come on now. Hey, look, it's what, De- Deathstroke is not that dude. Like the Teen Titans were his thing. Like Teen Titans, not Batman. All right, so it's a little part in here where he's talking to Batman when he stabs him, and it's almost like he's apologetic. Yeah. It's like, you know, 
If you don't take it out, you won't die. You know, like he does you, the whole John Wick to, to, yeah, to like, common and, come and, and John Wick too. Like, come on, man. man. I thought I thought oh. that was a little wild. I thought hey, they hey, should have did something different. Hey, I'm tired of seeing like you can't. Like, Batman is so hyped up, and then you see him in other forms of media, and he's that dude. Like, yeah. nobody's touching him, yep. nobody, you know. He's he's just ridiculous. Yep. And then you read these books, and it's like Deathstroke. <laughs> like, yeah, Deathstroke has such a cool look, yep. but who cares? Like, his gimmick is he's the world's deadliest assassin. Supposed to be. But who's he going to kill? Besides, I, I, like, like who? what superhero? If he gets hired to kill Superman, no. Nah. Batman, no. Nah. Who's he going to kill? Like, I don't know. I, I know. Well, like really, I, I know. he's gonna, he'd have to kill like Speedy or somebody that no one gives a damn about. Check this out, Aqualad. Oh, don't do that. All right, look, look. I don't know why, why you took it to the lad. But it's just I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad those good. those people are out of the story, yeah. and now we can focus on what's going Joker. on. And um, now we have to read every single Batman family book. Oh, Batman, Batgirl, oh. probably Detective, Nightwing okay. of all things. No, I am not. No, I am not. Oh, you're going to miss the story? Look, I'm not going to miss the story because I tell you what, it's going to get wrapped up in Batman. I'm going to just keep going Batman and then it's going to be wrapped up in well, Batman. I, 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 went in pre, I went in online and I ordered Nightwing 70 and 71. And then I think Bad Girl's the next one that comes out. That's yeah. the first time. Hey, look. Hey, look. I'm, I'm telling you. I'm telling you right now. Batman is my title. I go Batman. I go Justin. This whole... This, no, no. I, I might do the three Jokers thing. Yeah. yeah. You know, if they got a special issue for if that. They do yeah. that still. I don't know yeah, 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 But, no. Well, let me say this. Yeah. I'll, I'll close on this. Okay. What did you think about this, this book overall? It was great. It was great. I liked it. I think of all the Batman books that we've seen from Tidian Zone, I think this is the weakest one. Really? Yeah, yeah. I just, I can, I just was like, eh, whatever. I, I think there's just, it's this, it just didn't work for me. I didn't like the money grab. Yeah, I didn't the like money the grab money grab. Little, but how he, how uh, Deathstroke uh, came out of nowhere and, and had the little sad moment, you know, hey. I thought that know, was cool. That yeah. was nice. Um, like, show I mean, me he, had, was written, he was compassionate but I'm just tired of seeing Deathstroke in this other role I, but I can't like like I didn't mind it but if I felt like it, I didn't mind it because I felt like it was a callback to John Wick 2 and that yeah. was a badass moment yeah. you know but the whole designer thing you they set up a character who they didn't really hyper push the whole focus was on no. punchline so when they reviewed it, oh, he's really dead and it's like a robot. I was like, dude, I I didn't care two issues ago about this dude. Like, no. nobody cares. But hey, you got you got. The last issue line. was amazing though. Hey. The last issue I thought was was fantastic. But you got this one was a line. big. This one was a no. big downer for me. You got punch line. It is what it is. Okay, well, we good though. Hey guys, uh, give us a like, give us a subscribe, <laughs> hit us up in the comment section. You know, we definitely want to hear your thoughts on this. Let us know how yes. we're doing. And always, guys, thanks for uh, tuning in and support your local comic book shops. Peace.